All right, good morning here. Just wanted to get back at the applications. I've got a hub here off of uh, an old go-kart that we've got at a uh, college here. And you can see, well, you might not be able to see, you can see a little red line in there. This guy we use a lot for penetrant because it gives us real nice, bright, shiny indications and it just hasn't been cleaned. But let's just say that this guy hadn't been penetrant tested and we wanted to go through with uh, eddy current, test around these holes for cracks and uh, coming from the from the bolt holes there. So let's just do that. I've already set my machine up to uh, null on good material down on the bottom right hand side and you saw that last week with the video on how to set this up. So I've set it all up already. Okay, I've got my my crack detection referenced already. <clears throat> Let me just run that for you real quick. Got just a big crack signal right there and I know that that's coming off of this hub here. Like I said, I just wanted to orient the signal. So if I were to actually scan this, I want to make sure my null point's good, bottom right hand corner. At least for me, different strokes for different folks. Some people like to run them sideways, some people like to run them over here, down across the middle. Doesn't make me any difference as long as you know where you're going and where you're coming from. So, got my good null signal there. I like to null quite a bit, just so I know where I am. Okay, we're all pretty much coming back to the same area. So if I was going to scan around the outside of this, I'd see something that looks like this. I know that's my edge effect signals. Okay, I got edge effect and edge effect going up, nice big signal like that, curving back around towards home. Okay, so I'm just scanning through here and you see the dot pretty much just hanging out over here in the corner. Okay, and I'm just scanning back and forth. Looks like I see something right there. What do we got right there? Okay, if we were to look here, you would see a little bitty baby crack, but you probably can't see it coming out of your out of the camera there. But we got a nice big crack signal right there. Okay, so let's erase all that. We got a bunch of stuff going on. Let's look at that again. No. Okay, that's edge effect. Not right there though. That's a big crack. Okay, we know it's a big crack because of the angle. Okay, we've got that 40 degree angle thing. Through wall cracks give us a nice, big, beautiful 40 degrees. Okay, here's one right here. Let's re -null. Okay, nice big crack signal. Let's go back over here. Same thing. Okay, so we keep scanning. Edge effect. Okay, crack again. Still on a crack, still on a crack. Edge effect. Got another one right there. Okay, it's really squirrely. Let's erase. Okay, there he is. That's huge. Okay, big cracks. Now, I've got my gain turned way up so I can see what I want to see here. Edge effect. Don't worry about that. And now we're back to the crack signals. Okay, whoops. We've got something else right there. Another one. Now my dot's just hanging out down there. Now we're back to a crack. Okay? Really pretty simple. So, if, if I was just to null, let me back the scope up here just a little bit, and I was just going to scan across the side here. And you see my null signal is kind of moving around, but as I get around that edge, I make a big mess. So if I erase, let's re null. Okay, that's surface roughness. There's just a lot of surface roughness on this piece. But I get back up here and re null. I'm okay, I'm okay, and then nice big clean crack signals. Okay, as opposed to an edge effect signal, let's get back to null. Big crack signal, edge effect signal. Okay, so that way I, I kind of differentiate between the two where I can say, all right, I've got my nice big clean signal going up, edge effect's going to go back towards air. Any questions there? That's just one basic application of eddy current testing for cracks. Generally aircraft, uh, you'll see it in other places, but this is a huge aircraft use right here where we just scan across the top of a piece, null out. Okay, we've got our good material. We see a crack, it's going to pop up for us. We get edge effect, it's going to fall down lower for us. Alright, any questions there, feel free to email me.